And now we have the number one team in the world. Their entry fragger, it's Flusher. Definitely where it was good. <laughs> Well, look at this here. Flusher taking down Kerrigan. Long range spray to pick up Cajun as well. And it's back into a 3-3 three, three with a bomb. Down Flusher. Another headshot to take down Dupree. What a round here. Flusher back in full effect and sneaking up behind. Is he going to get a fourth one? He's got the timing for it. Catching him on the ladder. And Device is going to go down. It's going to be an ace. Flusher sprays and he's going to get it. All five members. He destroys TSM. Now from Locked off 90% of the map ultimately in this situation. And Flusha, he's just gonna spray through that smoke at Monster. Knows they've gotta be out there. They try and get aggressive. And Flusha, <laughs> he gets all five as he sprays through with the pistol to follow it up. So an ace from Flusha. Efficient is it? All four still up. Wasn't supposed to be all five when I started that sentence, but Flusha at least took down Kadian. He's gonna plant the bomb as well, so at least something to work forward in the next round, but he's still got a big task ahead of him. They've recovered a P90 and an AK-47. They need to read him pushing in, though. Magix goes down, and remember, there is low HP on two out of the three remaining players. And they oh. line up! This is a problem. This is disaster. It could be an ace clutch right now. I know it's an eco, but still, Flush has had to do so much just to get this far, and there's no kit. He's got all the time in the world to figure out what Freeze is up to. He's going to try and hold this, but Flusha, uh, Flusha uh, needs to hit it. Okay, he does. Oh my God. What an unfortunate turn of events. Who was massive on the first map. Needs this one for Fnatic. The crowd behind Virtus Pro in this one, but again, Flusher doesn't care. He wants this for himself. He gets the tag, but not the frag. Bialy and Taz closing in step by step. Flusher takes the first, looking for the second. Taz is leaving. Flusher gets two astounding kills, and again finding that form in the most imperative and Somehow, Seuss dropping very low as well, but Guardian is there with the first opening shot. Flusher dropping a little bit low here. They need to get in, get the bomb down, but Guardian cannot be stopped. He picks up another killer. Now it's down to Flusher. One on two, has to clutch it again. Fnatic, they're really, really having issues. And there's no rush here for Guardian. Guardian does not have to play aggressively here. Flusher, mm, are so you kidding me, Flusher? This is so intelligent. No, he, no one's going to check here. He's waiting. He wants to know where Starix is. Flusher is playing a masterful game. This is the absolute highest level of Counter-Strike right now. Beautiful, beautiful round from Flusher. He deserves to get this. He's going to walk out. Guardian has no idea. That's the kill. They wasted so much time. Flusher, he may have just done it. He's going to go down. No and time. there's no time. He did it anyway. Such intelligent play here from the Swedish player. That is why Flusher is a world-class player. Hello. They have an incendiary, two, two Molotovs actually, on, uh, well, if Guardian reacts that quickly, he's just lightning fast. Misses the second shot, goes for the wall bank attempt, and Flusher with the wall bank of his own through the smoke takes out Edward. Could spot out Guardian, but the cavalry has arrived. Flamey is already on the site, and while Seize is rotated around, how does Flusher find him in the smoke like that? The hell is going on? Six seconds, five seconds? And well, it's a one-on-one -on -one now. Seize just rotated on to the side. Flusher's only got the three bullets, but he's given time to reload. And now it's all on Seize. He's going to use that inside area to force him out into the open and Flusher with the clutch. How does that happen? Quad kill clutch from Flusher. Followed by the well-known Orper. It is JW. Back in towards B now. That boost could come back to bite them. They are censoring it though. And they're going to be nading off. And JW, of course, lands the first shot. They're going to be fully aware. What Make the it a hell? double. I'm in. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Stabilize that bank account in some close rounds. It's going to be Pronax onto the Famous there. Still JW with that old AWP there. He's going on short though. He's been boosted up. Going for the aggressive pick. And actually goes wow. all the way towards suicide and gets a huge headshot on the Garrigan there. What a massive pick that was. It's the AWP player Still as well. So. At long. Going to hit the leg shot there on Flusher and has to immediately fall back with Jade. What? He wants this madness. He's picking what? up behind the lines. He's going to get the kill on Sipnix and runs away. And that has to shake TSM. They have to be shaking their heads and thinking the only person in this whole game who would have done that was JW. You need to find a way to either smoke off cross or anything, but OK then. Uh, that that is works something. too. That is so sick from JW. Now that's an opening if I've seen one. 9-6 is, is what Fnatic are gunning for here. Let's see if they can do it. He misses that shot, does try and pre-fire it a little bit. They're in a 5-on-3, now a 5-on-2 as JW picks up the third kill. And they're going to keep pushing here. Kaylee's alive. Oh, it's Kenny that's gone. JW working on... Incredible, what? <laughs> How does he do it? He made it behind, but it's just that one round. As long as we can keep picking them up. We'll just do something else in the next round if we're limited on money, whatever. And there you go. JW once again picks up the kill on Kenny S. 
Fantastic. It really seems like the T op is the most powerful weapon here right now on Inferno Anders. Just changes. Could go either way, but um Oh, he's got the ankle right through the smoke. Absolutely beautiful, and that's another bit opening kill here. That is what Fnatic need. That's exactly what Titan did as well. Existence will get the return here on Crimson. Titan right now actually have to be a little bit concerned because the four round difference here is not that great. This is within the realm where Fnatic could definitely make a comeback happen. Oh, certainly, certainly. They are currently walking up onto the site, but I'm glad that they're all grouped up. If they can take this fight, Kaylee does manage to pick up the entry though, and this is going to slow things down for Fnatic. And he's going to get into position from Pit as well, and this is such a difficult position to get him out of. This, and they have a second member here at the bomb side, and there's already a rotation happening. Fnatic are actually in a horrible spot right now. As long as Titans stay cool, they're going to be fine. Oh. What a sick shot, and oh my god, JW, he gets the second one. He's looking for the ace. He's got just seven bullets, and he's going to go for it in the corner. Now it's a one-on-one. -on -one. He misses that shot. There's 25 seconds left, and he's got six health. He's going to go with a CZ. Sprays here. Existence trapped in the corner. Now 20 seconds. What? He gets the ace. Are you kidding? Oh my god, Fnatic, they win that round. Get out, JW! So when Get Right does that, gets himself a delayed double, it appears. JW has still not been dealt with. He's managed to get in. It's a squeaky. How has this worked? He gets himself another on Get Right. They push on through. He gets a massive tag onto Forrest. The nade's going to catch on Forrest. Oh my god, JW goes huge and exists his left. And in the middle, we have their leader, their in game leader. It's Dennis. Good players towards B. Now they know, but it's too late. Dennis with the fast frag on a simple. Sure, he could get the return, but the bomb will be planted. Dennis posting a defense by the APC now as that bomb ticks away. Three versus three as Dennis pops more heads. Is this guy done just yet? I don't even know. He's got all of my stuff for support as well. This is a very tough re entry for Liquid. What? Dennis is getting in there again, and there might be one more, of course. Dennis with the ace to kick off the second half. Fnatic needed that, and Dennis delivered. The smoke that's forward, that means they want to go in, and that's something that Rain understands. He goes for the spray. He can't see a single thing, though, but he's got Dennis to back him up with the AK-47. He's trying to get it done right now from the plateau, and Dennis takes everybody down. Four kills for him right now, but he's in a one-on-one. -on -one. Happy doing so much damage on the outskirts. And oh, Dennis is going to find the finish. On to Happy. The ace coming in. The first in. round, in the first map, excuse me, on Inferno, and we know You've said it enough times, and we've definitely seen it proved that Dennis is extremely good on these pistols to start that momentum off. Fast play, very fast play, and there it is! Oh my god, Dennis on cue, on point, all three kills again. I'm done. Don't even buy guns. Just this guy could use a USB for the entire game, and I would be convinced, because G2 certainly has to be convinced. It might be the ace to Dennis with an absolutely perfect round. Absolutely gutted. There's Forrest as well. He's in a push down twist. And Dennis is sitting on the bomb site. It's like, well, you got to plant the bomb. This and is interesting though, because Nip can't afford to take the one v ones here because almost all their plays are tagged apart from Freiburg. So Dennis could actually oh. make this one versus one. Oh. Here it is. He's gonna clutch it for the team. That was I love those kind of dynamics where there's more players, but they're all like one bullet away from dying. Nice smoke on mid, so they had to bring the AWP player Dennis back inside of safety segregated away from his support system, but now we are seeing a little bit more aggression in Banana. Great shot by Dennis to open this up, but now they're starting to push the offense the way they want them to, to force the play as the Kinguin have Fox down low, and Dennis comes up, big three, make it four! This is a big round from him! He's up in CT Sky, lurking above. It's not a good position though. Oh, he's gonna make noise oh, with the ladder. Dear. Oh, great flick there. Gets the second one as well. Dennis is a machine. There's a third player. Oh my god, how on earth did he pull that one off? 11 HP left at the end of that. Amazing stuff from Dennis. And, and then King Dennis Win. comes in with four one digs. And here it is. This is really, that's just enjoy this. Oh man. Dude. So that's three. And then the last one is this one. The round was had at this point, but what a round to deliver. That magnetic or sensational end. Desert Eagle kills. That's really big. Followed by what is considered to be the best player in the world by a lot of people. It's Olaf Meister. Actually, I mean, you can't be thinking of going for it. Just looking for potential exits here. And, uh, there's one frag. Oh, the bomb position. Oh he could God. go for the defuse. Oh, wow. Yes, she gets a kill as well. He can do this. He can, he can actually hold it. Oh, he can. He's got to hold it. Has he got time? 
Oh my god, it's gonna be close. This is ridiculous. Out of my Are you seriously doing this? Oh, oh my god, <laughs> you cannot be serious. What is this? Did that actually happen? <laughs> oh my god, that is the money absurd. For it, dude. They're gonna go here. He'll come around CT. This will catch off on Fugly. That's one man down. Adrenzen Sandwich. He's not gone back to the stairwell. Okay, good thing he got that kill on Pronax because that could have been a very awkward situation. The trouble now is he's your high HP player. So Daps gets caught. He has to win this one-on-one. -on -one, and he's not going to do it. Olaf gets him. And in that case, why does he not fall further from the site? He's aiming through the smoke. It's going to be one. Can he find a second? He does have time. He's been given time. He's going to find a second. It's a third. Flesh is there with two as well. And Versus Pro do not take he a goes play. That second set of doors right now, Pronax. He could walk in behind them. They've gotten to mid. But look at this position. Olaf Meister. They don't check it. One, two, and three. Perfect play from Olaf That first shot. He's going to have a second bite of the cherry here. He is back towards the chicken cube. Not going to be playing too aggressive. He makes his face and actually missed the shot. Olaf, Olaf Meister takes him down. Fantastic shot. Again. Make it two. Takes down Happy as well. That's a really amazing oh. play from him. He gets the 3K there. And Crim's finishing. Desperately hard to hold on to device around the world we go but the diffuse the diffuse is coming in has it he's still going oh Olaf just about gets it as the flames come in and look at the little dance of happiness that is how to control your nerves in a situation dance it out he spots it out and Olaf I mean still just wanting to push forward is he gonna do this he does he finds one he's gonna take that battle he gets a second out of Dupree incredible play from the star and he's just gonna fall away now with two kills this is sickeningly good performance from someone like Olaf Meister. Above and beyond sort of stuff. This guy. It's going to be that retake scenario. Crims has the kit. Crims currently working through mid with Dennis and Flusher. And as a pistol player, hey, Dennis isn't the bad person to have going in front of you. But Zimnix going to be holding the back. Carrigan on site. And well, it's Device holding close towards CT. Zimnix spots three of them out. But it's Olaf again to find Device. And Olaf coming in with four. He wants the ace. And he gets it. There we go. What a superstar performance from that man. As well, now it's back into a two on two. Going to go for the beat. He gets a shot on Dennis. And Olaf is miles away from this action. They don't have a smoke. So this Olaf is still. Oh! oh! Somehow they land. And this guy is an expert holding sights on his own. The rifle for Fnatic. And he's got a new hat. It's Crims. He actually turns back, gets flush as well. So good awareness that they know exactly where he was going to come from based on how he plays the map. Olaf's got to hit the shots here from the kitchen. Gets the first. That's a liege down. Can he find more? The op still scoped in and looking toward the jail. Bombs down though, up close, and Nitro gets him. Very low HP for Nitro, but against the off, no condition. Look at Crims though, on the entry from the backside, controlling that recoil, two down already, make it three on a Dren, and it's down to a one-on-one. -on -one. Baits out the bomb carrier, there's your, pardon me, the bomb plant with that defuse. Dap's gonna try and take this fight, and he runs, he runs no. Daps, that's no. the second time this match, he goes He's for the beat. They heard the plant happy, tried to go aggressive, tried to rattle the shots through, but as you saw, MBK, he's going full on. He's just ready to pounce on through. And why would they slow down? There's the flash. That's going to catch Crims out. They're going to push on through. MBK gets one, but Crims with a spray down. He gets himself the triple. The Fnatic are not done yet. Can you believe it? What? Resistance is just over the other side here. Going to flash onto the other side, trying to keep him guessing, trying to keep him wondering where the hell is he. And <laughs> Crims. There it is. Crims, why you gotta be like that, man? He's gone for the spray and he gets it. Now 1v1. He's got a hell of a lot of health and a molly, but time is running out here. He's gonna make the move and make it fast. Shocks just needs to buy time, but he goes for the peak. He's down to 10 HP. This could be a clean pickup, but if there's time left, I would have kicked myself, but I think we are out of time here. Surely uh, not on this. This is this is actually no. I think he's got it. Yep. He's just got it. What the That's hell? That's the is extra five doing? seconds right there, and some players still aren't adjusted yeah, to it. On the clock for gamers two. Sorry, G two. Sorry, G two to get some work done. Rain to try and look over the smoke, but he will pay for it with his life. Crims are two frags. Aggressive hold here from Fnatic. Still got two men in control, and Crims will play the bait for Olaf to get the max seven kills. The money maker looking for that paper. Yeah, I, I feel pretty good that we pick Crims considering his performance so far. He's actually looking like he might finish off the entire rest of the team. There's one, there's two, there's one more player left. It's Dennis, he's low and he's out of there. Crims looking for the ace, but he will be denied. Dennis is going to get himself to safety, but for how long will he stay alive? Looks like Fnatic are considering going for the hunt. He will be spotted, he will get the kill onto JW. His position now given away. It's given away. Crims is closing in. Is he going to get it?
Yes. In the words of Styles P, then, don't want to be the king, I'm the ace of this. And the Molotov comes down as well. Strux is going to take a heck of a lot of damage from it. He gets back to CT at least, and Flush of Poku's head out a little bit too far. But now Crims has to hold from this corner. Molotov comes out, it's in the wrong direction. He gets a spray down at one, two, he's looking for spinning. Oh! He gets it with a cheeky little headshot. And there is Fnatic getting another one on top. And as you said, that is Crims' bread and butter.